Welcome back to Let's Play Snow Brothers. We've missed you. Anyway, <laughs> last time, remember, we were on the thirty-four. We were on the thirty-sixth floor, and the thirty-sixth floor means nothing to us. Because the thirty the thirty sixth floor only means everybody's about to get their asses handed to them. Now we are moments away from our next boss. And like I like I promised I said I was going to. I was going to actually do more of my um, Shining Force Let's Play. We're now inches away from our, our what's this, our third boss? Yeah, our third boss. And we're all facing these assholes. And believe it or not, monies! We got monies! We have yens, we have monies. Bonuses. Now, what I like to do here Is not try to get caught here because the setup here is just terrible. So what you want to do here is just just let your adversaries just come to you. Tom, ta tom, tom, toms. 440. We're facing this, whatever the fuck this thing is. I gladly call him the snot monster. Yeah, I shall call him the snot monster. Oh, well, anyway. <laughs> how do we take care of the snot monster? We had to shoot. We had to shoot his boogers. Because he will slowly, slowly drop down to us. Oh yeah, he's taking a sweet time for us. But what you want to do is be careful because even if you hit him, you become a target. So just keep hitting him, all the while staying out of his way. So wait for a bit. Because after which he will somehow bring more hot Cheetos on you. For he will kill you with your bad breath. With his bad breath. Sir, I don't know if you have noticed this, but you do reek of Cheetos. Hot Cheetos. And once again,
Yeah, I still haven't gotten the words, no. But anyway, we're up to 41. This one... Well... You don't really have to worry, because... You can actually get rid of everyone here. So with that, we're going up to the 40s. It's a good thing you can drop... Because all you're going to do is drop endlessly back to the bottom of the floor. Just like Bubble Bobble. Of course, the only thing you're going to be phasing here are these hoity-toity Nouveau Reach types. I think they might be anti-nerd. So, we get a cherry for an extra 10,000. We got more of these gnafs. They look like gnafs to me, anyway. Just drop down, get rid of them, and booyah. Next. I mean, really, such a good game. Really underrated. I, I doubt anybody actually remembers Snow Brothers. Or even if they do, they might have been kids. I was in junior high when this came out. But then again, that was when, um, Nintendo games were getting scarce. I mean, Nintendo games getting scarce. Now you know something was up if Nintendo games were getting scarce. Super Nintendo wasn't even a thing then. Just Nintendo games were just getting more and more scarce. The demand for Sega games were coming in stock and everything. Like I said, I was... Like I said, I was um, a kid when, when this came out. Uh, yeah, be wary of these guys. They come near you. Snowball them. Ugly little gnafs. Or gnafs. They look like gnafs. Anyway. Moving on. We're up to the... We're up to going near the fifth boss. But we need to take care of these bats first. And we're at 49. Believe it or not, yeah. Works for me. Tom, ta tum tum tums. It's the Tums theme. We are here at what seems to be the final boss. Believe it or not, yeah, this is the final boss. 
The trick here is to basically turn everything into, to use your ice powers to actually get rid of them. So, this will take precise accuracy. The last thing, you, the only thing you don't want to do is get yourself popped. So, the one thing you're going to have to do is just avoid getting hit. And it seems like this boss is going to take forever. So, attack fast. I mean, very fast. So, I'm going to go to auto fire mode. At least pause it for a bit. If not enough, well. The only thing you can do is basically try to get rid of the boss by using its own minions at him. So, unlike Bubble Bobble, whereas you can only get you can only get the good ending if you have two people Snow Brothers actually fixed that So we're at the last boss, and we must get rid of We must make sure not to get hit. I mean get hit. <laughs> we must make sure we don't get hit. Make sure not to get in. And make sure that we don't allow ourselves to get caught. So it is a must to make sure you wiggle that D pad. Make sure you wiggle and waggle. That D pad. And as you can see, one is down. So now we must get rid of the second one. So I think the trick here is just basically stay out of the way. And therefore, we have taken them down. And so, we have finished the game. And after a vicious battle, Nick and Tom finally rescue the twin princesses. Terry and Tina. I have to read like this. Hell no. I hope she doesn't have cold lips. Well, yeah, when the princess kissed Nick and Tom, oh, <laughs> they suddenly went back to normal. But yeah, of course. <laughs> so now we find out that. This is all over. I think 
it'd be wise to see the ending sequence, don't you?